guys, it's Darlene and welcome to my channel. All right, what are we talking about today? The infamous white jeans. Oh, those jeans that are just so hard to get right. So I have been on the search. I have ordered so many pairs of white jeans. I've returned so many pairs of white jeans. I am gonna show you the top five. Three are my favorite. Two didn't work for me, but two I think can work for other body types. Not every jean is going to work for every body type, right? And I have every price point. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Right, first and foremost, if you're already subscribed to my channel, I just want to say thank you so very much. And if you are not yet subscribed and these videos are of interest, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. All right, so I was on the look out for the perfect pair of jeans and I ordered so many pairs in different um, price points because I think that's very important. My measurements will be in the description box as they always are. Since this is all about uh, the white jean, I did not change the shirt. I had the same shirt and and then I also showed them with bare feet because I think it's important, you know, what if you want to wear flats or sandals or tennis shoes to give you an idea of where they fall um, on the ankle balls and then I put paired them all with the white Sam Edelman sandals so that you could see where it would they would fall with the sandals so I wanted them to be all uniform because this is all about the white jean not doing a lookbook all right guys so I am sneaking in another pair of white jeans these are by Paige these are the high rise ankle skinny. I got them in a size 28 and oh my gosh, they may be my favorite. They came in late, totally forgot that I had ordered them and this video is going live tomorrow. So I thought I am jumping on here and I'm showing you these jeans. So here's what I love about them. Um, one, the pockets don't show. Keep in mind with all the other jeans i did have a nude pair of panties on this one i had purple <laughs> it's because it was what i was wearing today but i just wanted to jump in try the jeans on so if you could see i don't think that you can but if you could see a little bit of purple panties kind of ignore them um but they have the streamlined pockets so they just you know you don't have anything here which is great gives it a nice flight flat front there's nothing, absolutely nothing, no stitching, no nothing on the um, pockets. Uh, they are a beautiful jean, a more dressy jean because they do have the hem is, um, is completely finished. It is a little bit longer, so you can wear it with heels. You can also wear it with flats. You can also cuff it. Um, and um, they feel amazing. Now I did get a size 28. I've never tried Paige jeans before. I think I'm going to also, I'm going to keep these and I'm going to also order a smaller size and see because I feel like if I'm wearing these, these might give a little bit because they do have quite a bit of stretch to them. Um, and they are a very, um, not so much jean material is more stretch but they're still a jean. Does that, I'm hoping that I make sense when I say all of that. Let's start with the first pair. These are by Gap. Um, I got them in a size 28. They are a true skinny. These are a bright white. Sorry, I thought I saw something that was so funny. Um, these are a bright white. These are a high rise. And I would say they've got have um, some stretch to them, but they're more of a structured denim, if that makes sense. Fit the hem at the bottom is finished. Um, they are a little bit longer than the rest of the ones I'm going to show you, but I still think they're a perfect length. Um, now, uh, so some of the positives on this. Now I'm going to show you something that's very interesting. Um, Okay, so pockets can be kind of problematic. Um, you're either going to find a pair without pockets, which I do have to show you, um, or you're going to see the pocket um, seam. Um, this, what they did was they basically took it and went across the whole length here. Um, and so then that gives it this panel, which I was like, at first I was like, oh, I don't know, but the more, the more I liked it because it gave your stomach a very flat look, which of course, who doesn't love that? So, um, 
I like these. These are definitely a contender. Um, price, I'm going to put all the prices in the description box. Um, but this is a really beautiful, what I love about this is this is a dressier jean because of the finished hem and the longer length. So I really like them. The next pair um, are by Wit & Wisdom. I love Wit & Wisdom. Um, Y'all know if you've been watching my channel for any length of time, Wit & Wisdom is one of my favorite jeans. Um, I had never tried their white jeans, but I have I have their regular denim, black denim. I have them with the butter. Uh, during the Nordstrom's anniversary sale, they had the uh, button front. Oh my gosh, they sold out. Knew they'd sell out. Um, they're gorgeous. I have those in regular denim and black denim as well. And I have a pair in brown. So yes, I'm a fan of Wit & Wisdom. I think the price point is very nice. Um, for the quality of jean that you're going to get. The other thing, if you get, these are the absolution. Meaning, you see how this band has, I don't want to say elastic, but that stretch around it, that hugs you, and that way you're not pulling up your, you know, your jeans throughout the day, um, which is what I love. These are a high-rise ankle skimmer, and these are in a size 6. Now, I typically wear a four in Wit & Wisdom. I went up one size in pretty much all the jeans, and there was a mistake in doing that in several. This is one of them. I needed my original size um, because there is a gap. Um, I, I'm a size four in Wit & Wisdom, regardless of whether they're denim or white. Um, but um, this is a beautiful jean. This is, a, again, a very nice crisp white jean um this is a short this is also a finished hem slightly shorter than the gap so this is more of an ankle length where the other is more of a regular length um yes you could see the pockets uh but gosh it's so minor you guys um these are just so beautiful and so comfortable um and just very streamlined there's not a lot of gadgets on the back of the pockets or anything like that so um love these um the price on these are 68 dollars a slimming panel so there's slimming panels in there constructed to mold and hold and boost your assets so who doesn't love a booty that's a little bit lifted a lot lifted in my case um so great pair of jeans okay the next pair okay the next pair by vince camuto these are a ultra white um they call it an ultra white but in comparison to the first two i showed you this is not this is slightly off white so if you're looking for crisp white no these are not they're slightly off white it's not an ivory or anything but just to show you the difference i don't know if the camera's going to pick that up but it's an off white they call it an ultra white it is not sorry but it's coming out but no uh this is an ankle length mid-rise and um, I got it in a size uh, 29. This is one of the ones where I should have uh, done a 28 or a size 6. Um, these are beautiful as well. You do see a little bit of the pocket. It's just going to happen. Um, I love that there's nothing, absolutely nothing on the back of the pockets. And then my favorite part probably is I love the little fray detail on the um, hem at the bottom of the ankle. So cute. Um, and it shows, it sits perfectly. You can still see the strap of the um, sandal and um, they just look great. Uh, this is um, where I would say this is a, this has definitely got more stretch than the gap. It definitely has a lot of stretch in these ones. Uh, so very nice as well. Now those are my three favorites. The next two are not for me. The next pair is by AG Jeans. This is the Prima Ankle, cigarette ankle. Um, and this is a mid-rise. I got it in a size 29. And um, uh, this one... Uh, 29 and it was too big um, so yeah I wasn't really I don't know why I went up on any of them well there is a pair that I did have to go up on um, again it does have the pockets uh, mid-rise and there's a little bit of scrolling on the back pocket but nothing too distracting uh, the um, bottom is uh, a finished hem uh, a very true ankle length so you can see that it is shorter 
than the first pair, which was the um, Gap. Uh, this is the here's my issue with this, and and, and this is just my body, right? I, I um, right in here, I don't like how it it just fits um, in this particular area, and uh, going down a size is not going to help that fit. Um, I keep wanting to pull them up, and then it gives it that you know that what it, I don't know is it just me or you know that kind of that pull look these weren't for me um, but they are a nice bright white beautiful jean if you like AG jeans then and they fit your body um, I would say that if you're curvy these are probably not the best jeans um, I'm a curvy girl and um, they just didn't work for me okay the last pair is a pair of for all mankind, seven for all mankind. Uh, these are in a size 28, and this is the Roxanne Ankle Slim Cigarette. These do not have pockets, so these are faux pockets, just decorative. So you have that very flat uh, look, uh, seamless uh, look to it. Uh, there is a little bit of stitching detail on the back pocket, but nothing distracting. Um, these are a mid rise. Um, they're a mid-rise, but I would say they sit slightly lower than a mid-rise. These are not meant for girls with booty. I have a booty, okay? I just do. I have girl, you know, again, curves, curves, hello. Um, and so, uh, oh, and these ones, by the way, absolutely had to size up. Size up on, on these ones. Um, so I did size up to an 8 and I needed it. Um, however, in the back, um, it, it just sunk so low you could see my uh, panties. <laughs> um, you know you don't want that uh, so it didn't work for me I think that if you are more of a not so curvy then these these could absolutely work for you it's a nice bright white um, this one also has the kind of the raw ham or the little French ham which I do like um, but again this was not a favorite pair for me for many reasons um, one the cut up for where they sat and the second, it just made my butt look, didn't do anything for my butt. Made my butt look terrible and we don't need that. Okay, so let's kind of do a little recap here of the jeans. My favorite pairs obviously were the first three that I showed you. Um, and let me just kind of tell you a little bit, a little, I'm gonna tell you a little more detail of how they compare to one another. For a true jean, true jean with a little bit of stretch, the gap would be for you. If you're looking for a the longest leg, the gap would be for you. Um, if you are looking for a pair that are very light, but are gonna hold you in, raise your booty, have a nice ankle length to it, Wit and Wisdom is probably um, the best pair. I love those. And if you like a raw hem, I mean, I love the hem on the Vince Camuto. I think these are just so darling. Um, but I do have a raw hem already um, and a pair of white jeans from last year from Gap. So, um, but otherwise I would keep these as well because I just, I love the hem. And again, just keep in mind these are slightly off white versus optic white. You know, like these two are, now um, let me just say with the wit and wisdom, I'm going to show you here. These are my two favorite. Um, this is these are the gap they have a little bit of stretch these are the wit and wisdom they have more stretch so if you're looking for a true jean material with a little bit of give then the gap would be for you and the price point I think these ones are very similar price point wise um, but again I'll have list them here this is more of a um, it's a jean obviously it is a jean but it has that very smooth look to it versus you could tell this is a jean and this is more of a pant feel with jean in it. Does that make sense? <laughs> I hope I'm making sense. I'm trying to give you all the detail I can. So guys, that, anyways, that, these are the two that I'm going to keep. I do have to turn these in for a smaller size and I think I went with the size 6 in or 28. What did I go with the with the gap with the gap I went with a 28 and that fit um, fine in, in this the video I hope you enjoyed it and if you did give it a thumbs up hope you enjoyed the video and as always have a great weekend and have a very blessed Easter I will see you next week bye guys